Hey guys, Joey here, Joe's RV Tech DIY. So today I was gonna do a quick video for you guys. Um, you know, what about when you empty your black tank and it still reads full on the monitor panel? Sometimes what happens is, is um, the toilet paper and other debris and stuff can get stuck on the sensors inside the black tank. And you always wanna make sure you're using toilet chemical, but what you can do Sometimes before you take off on a trip is, see this toilet right here? If you open her up and pour a couple bags of ice inside your black tank and then put, you know, put some water in it too. Um, at each level, you know, you could do it at a quarter, half, three quarters. You should never really do it at full, but because ice weighs a lot. And um, <clears throat> one thing that that'll do is it'll help break up, break up any debris that's on the side of the actual tank itself near the sensors so that's just a little trick of the trade that some of us do alternatively you can buy the magic wand and you can run it down the toilet and uh, it just sits there and spins and spins and spins another thing you can do is use the clean out on your rv so right here is the city water right here this is for the tank flush clean out now this thing has a little sprayer nozzle on the inside too and it sits there and it sprays in a circle and it actually is supposed to be installed in a way that it sprays your sensors to get any debris that's left on them. So the biggest thing is, is make sure you're using the toilet tank treatment chemical for RVs. And uh, second, if you don't have a clean out, you could get one installed or you could try the ice trick or you can buy the magic wand. That's what I call it. They sell it. I'll post some links below. But um, just know it's a pretty common problem for a lot of RVs. And unless you have experience cleaning the tanks, it can be a little bit challenging at times. But one of the fastest ways sometimes is just to throw some warm water and a couple of the bags of ice down into the tank and drive it around. So anyways, I hope this video will help somebody out there. Until next time, thanks for subscribing and safe travels, you guys.